My name is Sean and uh, I was shockingly diagnosed with um, prostate cancer at age 50, learning that you now have something that potentially could impact your entire life as well as your families. It was important for me to understand who am I giving that trust to. Sean got a PSA, he's a young man, but his PSA was elevated and he had a biopsy. And the biopsy showed that he had what we would consider low-grade prostate cancer, but one of the biopsies showed that it was a little bit in that intermediate category. There are a lot of treatments for prostate cancer, multiple options, and it can be confusing. What tends to happen is that the patient who has prostate cancer is directed toward one particular treatment depending on the physician that he sees. And I think it would be a good idea if patients were to explore all the options, learn as much as they can about each of the options. And that's one of the things that I admire about Sean. He wanted to know what his options were and he wanted to know everything about each option. I know what I want out of this. I want to be cured first, and second, I want to have the quality of life that I have tomorrow just like what I have today. When you hear about the success rate and also the limited side effects being less of an invasive treatment, for me it just kind of made sense. So my wife and I talked it over and said, you know, this is the right thing for us. CyberKnife is um, a way of delivering radiation, but it's extremely high dose and intense. The word cyber knife implies that it, there's a knife involved, but there isn't. It's given that name because it can deliver doses of radiation that are extremely high and surround the target volume, but a few millimeters away the dose drops off to spare normal adjacent organs, almost as though you had a knife just cutting it out. I love what I do. Some would say I'm a little bit of a workaholic, which is why it was important for me to also kind of look at a treatment plan that I knew I could continue to go back to work after the treatment, and CyberKnife allowed me to do that. The CyberKnife has a more favorable side effect profile than many of the treatments for prostate cancer, and it's also a short course of treatment. It's just five very large treatments, usually given over a two-week period. One of the things that was appealing to me about CyberKnife was the little to no side effects, and that's exactly what I experienced. I had five treatments in 10 days. That's appealing, and, and what I found doing the research was exactly that. One of the most important ways that we measure success in any treatment for prostate cancer is the PSA. Six months after his cyber knife treatment, his PSA went from 6.4 down to 1.4. If that PSA goes from its pre-treatment value down to some low number, usually less than 0.1, and stays there for a long time, the odds are extremely high that that patient is cured. I've been using CyberKnife to treat prostate cancer since about 2009, and I use it for patients who have low risk and what we term intermediate risk prostate cancer. And our success rate in those patients I would estimate to be in the high 90s, and that's consistent with what's reported in the literature as well. The team here at St. Louis CyberKnife is amazing. They really work hard to put you at ease, to answer as many questions, to give you kind of the, the knowledge to help ensure that you're making the right decision for me to be able to come in for my appointments and know that I'm entrusting myself and my situation to a dedicated set of staff members and physician was really, really important to me. They're an excellent team to work with. They care about their patients. They care about their patients' lives in addition to just being a patient with prostate cancer. CyberKnife, to me, was really that partner that allowed me to ensure I have the quality of life that I had before the diagnosis. This whole experience, it's not about the diagnosis, it's more important about the treatment plan and knowing that CyberKnife has ensured uh, the quality of life that I had before the diagnosis means the world to me. It really does give you the quality of life that every man and family deserves.